Hello everyone and welcome back to Factory Town. We are on episode 2 of our brand new series. We left off last episode with researching a whole bunch of stuff, getting set up to start making some... What are we making? Wing conveyor belts. And what do they take? They take two of each, so it takes a little bit of time. Which is okay. We have, we have some time. We're making planks, going to our general store. Lots of planks going in. We got our school. Can we do any more research? We need 100 and we got 78. And that civics level one, that unlocks um, the next level of stuff here. And we're almost at, or sorry, no, that doesn't do that. Your tech level does that. So we're, we're good on our tech level here. We need to also make wooden wheels. We only need 10 of them. Now, wooden wheels are made, again, at a workshop. So we could just kind of skimp these in here which i really don't want to do but if we add a couple workers like that and all we need to do is i just want enough just to get the next tier up and we actually have some conveyor belts in here which is excellent so i can just go like that and grab uh grab wheels and you can actually go here and you can grab conveyor belts and then you can go here as well. This is where you start not needing people anymore. Or, you, or needing, a lot, I should say, needing a lot less people. What is the problem here? Oh, it's just super slow. Let's get three workers in here. I want to start pumping this out because this needs to fill up. We need planks. So right now these two, got, these two workers have nothing to do because I basically took away their job. And I'm about to do it here. Let you drop that off. And here as well which is kind of stinks. And we're gonna go here like that. And this one's gonna grab paper. This one's gonna grab planks. Look at that. We just got rid of, rid of is not the right word, four jobs. But look how much simpler it's going now. It's a constant stream, there's no back and forth. This is a constant stream once they're making it, which they're not, what are they doing? Uh, let's just add two more workers. And what we can do here is we can just go ahead and we can delete these guys, sorry. We can actually delete these two, we don't need these. The water you still, I think, I don't think it'll automatically put about, but we can get water pipes eventually. All right, we're doing good. Oh, look at that. We have our next tech level already. Look at all we can research. Farming, forestry, which is going to be great. We're really going to have to, well, we're, we will really be able to start producing things now. Logistics, boat building. I've never done boat building yet. Kitchen, fluid pipes. I love the fluid pipes. Tailor, coin boosters, wooden railways. Awesome. Awesome, awesome. Let's go into here, actually. Let's see, civics level one. It gives you plus one town center and it gives you plus two for your housing. So it'll basically it'll make everything um, will be better. <laughs> and then we want to get in here right away. Oh, we only have 42. So I want to get farming. I love the fluid pipes. I think that'll be the first thing I do. Um, and I'll show you exactly how that works. And, and rare, there we go, fluid pipes. Now fluid pipes you have to make, but they're made. Where are they made? Are they made here? They're made here from simple wood, which is so simple. So all we're going to do is we're going to put down, and this is where, again, this is where the crates do come in handy a bit. And we can put this actually here, put a conveyor belt here, grab it to fluid pipes, and there you go. Because we don't need tons of fluid pipes, but I do want to put a fluid pipe in for these houses. And we can put the well right here. Now, the way this works is, let's see if we can get some pipes. It's under your pipes, of course, and you drag this down to... Uh, that I will redo these eventually. I'm not sure what the hotkeys are to. Oh, it's F2. That's like a logistics one. This is a building one. This is just a general one. Now, how much fluid pipes do we have? Now, I like to put the fluid pipes on the hot bar, so I know how many I have. And also the same thing with the the wooden conveyor belts, just so I know how many we have. Now we should never have more than twenty, because they're only going into here. Um. Cloth conveyor belts we, we will start making eventually. Now the way the fluid works is if you hit G, it gives you kind of like your underground view. And the, f the way these work is you just drag them. Actually, you could probably drag it like that and then just go, no, that's not gonna work, sorry. <laughs> Whoopsies, that won't work. That won't work. And there we go, okay, that was dumb. Now, that should work, and that should work, right? Do that, to that, 
do this to this and then oops do now, I mean you could just drag one to the next or whatever but um, we're not gonna actually put any more actually we could just do it like this oh and now I'm out of pipe come on three so we need a couple more and now when you click on your house it gives you your happiness from water which is only one yellow corn one experience one happiness but that's constant it'll always keep plugging away because this puts out a certain rate uh put out puts out one every two one every two seconds so um yeah one every two seconds which isn't the greatest but eventually it doesn't take much to saturate this like it doesn't at all do one more and there you go like this is already saturated um there you go because what happens is because uh can you actually put a let's test that can you put a splitter in these oh you can let's see that's the way to go because it's not you have to wait for all these to fill up that's the ticket now, it doesn't really matter because these will eventually get saturated with water anyway. These don't have any yet because they're the farthest ones, but these have four. Now, look at our coins. They're ticking up every second or every water duration is what? 10 seconds. So every 10 seconds, we're going to be getting a coin because we have 10 houses. We're going to be getting one per second just on water, which is, which is passive. It, it took basically nothing to make, which is excellent. And what we're doing here, yeah, this is kind of a bit wonky. And yeah, we are running out, which is fine because we have a whole patch of, it's all the way over here. So that's a little bit far away. But what we can do is we can drag a path across the water, just like that. I'm going to let this f empty out because, well, I'm just going to let it empty out. And I think what we might actually do is when this finishes, I'm going to connect this up to the cotton and we can run the cotton where does the cotton go to? I think the cotton goes to the general store. So we can run a belt thing right over to that. Okay, this is great. We're off to a pretty good start, I would say. Now the next thing I want to get working on is I want to get ready working on a farm. Just your basic... Oh. Do I have to research that? Farming. Yes. Thank you. What else can we get? Nothing right now. So a form. Let's just pause it for a sec. A form. Uh, where do we want to put it to maximize our yield? Um, I know how it works. Thank you. Um, can I, I don't want that tooltip though. How do I make oh, so I want it to be? Oh, it tells you how many there. Right to the 21. If you put it right in the middle, it'll be linked to 51. Actually, that'll be linked to 51 as well. That'll cover all of them. Even though you're going to be using some up here, that's actually okay. And then I want to go right to putting in a... Oh, we can't afford a food meal yet. Um, oh, wait, what? Why are they... What's in this person? Oh, just pause, duh. Sorry. We'll just fill this up with stone. It's fine. What was it saying? Oh, yeah. I want to put in a food mill. Which was under food mill. We need 10. And we should be getting one more. There we go. And the food mill is going to go. I should have actually put this in a different manner. But we can put a food mill here. And we are going to make flour. Simple enough. And we're going to take this. Drag that into that. And this is going to start rolling out. This is producing at a rate of one every two seconds. But if we put a bump this up, we have one per second. Water and fertilizer won't do anything until we turn these into farm tiles, which that's where your bonus comes in. See, your yield is at 20%, 30% back here. If we start putting farm tiles here, the yield will go up to 60% and it'll, go, it'll continue to go up. Now, the next thing we need to do is can we build wagons? Yes, we can. Yes, we can. We could actually build two wagons which is a bit i don't know if that's the best course of action yeah it's okay right because we want this one to grab flour and we're gonna take it all the way over to our 
That's actually very far. Um, hold on. Let's make a path over here and then to th there. That's a bit far as well. Pick this up and we're going to dump it here. And then we're going to do the same thing with this one. Now they should never, well, they won't ever collide on, on this because I'm going to actually make this, make this too wide. That when they come back, they'll never get kind of stuck. Look at that. It goes up. The terrain goes up a little bit, a little hump there. These guys will bump into each other, but those go around. It's not a big deal. And yeah, we're going to be outputting like crazy here. Again, this is why we need conveyor belts, but this is a bit, a bit far. How far is our, you know what though? Let's pause it. Right now, the only thing going into our town center is grain. We could put our, we could put our, sorry, we could put our food market all the way over here. Because we actually have apples. We have, I think we're going to do that. Let's move this. Actually, no, wait. I want to, I want to finish this up. There's 20 to go. And when that's finished, I want to then get rid of, we can, we can move all of this stuff. This can actually go away now. Let's let it make one more flower. Or actually, I should come in here and just do that. And have it delete that. And then you can go bye-bye. Sorry, buddy. I'm going to let this one finish. Which will be any second now. I'll delete all of this. And we'll move the food market over here. Because then it's a lot shorter of a distance. We can actually, but we can actually convey our belt it in. Ooh, research. Where's our research at? Forestry, which is good. That's with trees. I think the next thing I want to get, though, uh, we should, I don't know. I want to start messing with railways. I've never done railways before. Okay, good. This is all done. So these guys, sorry, you're going to go bye-bye. And the shoots, I wish I could, like, I just don't, I just don't need it. I just, there's, no, there's no point to keep it here right now. There we go. And we're going to take this, and then we're going to move this right here. Oh, let's see. It has to be within this this circle, so we can put it here. Now these guys should still grab to that just fine, and they do. And we can still connect that path. We can get rid of that. Okay, cool. And that's a lot shorter of a distance, and you know what? How many belts do we have? I wonder if it makes sense to conveyor belt this in. We don't have enough, but we're gonna get some very quickly. And what I wanna do is I wanna scaffold up here I think if you go up two, you can then um, belt. Oopsies. Uh, how do I do this this way, right? Do that. And then this here. This I might actually have to. No, 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 no. I don't want to mess this up. Come on, move. I want to. Well, I guess I have to delete it because you can't really do anything any different. So I'm going to grab this. We're going to go up to this. And that should work, right? That way the carts can still get underneath it. Yes, 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 yes. That is awesome. So we're inputting. We just need to go faster. Can we go up to... We can only go up to five because... Oh, no, wait, 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 wait. This is going to now uh, be deleted. And this cart is going to be deleted. Because you don't need it. Oh, I shouldn't have deleted them. I should have just moved them. Oh, well. Yes, this is great. Now, as long as this... I think this is like one per second, maybe. And we can't go higher than five for our workers. But this is great. Our grain's coming in. Let's advance this up. Another two. Because what you want to do is you want to be able to match this. You want the input to be coming in the same as the output. And right now, we are just matching it. Four, one, four, zero. So we can go up one more here. Because we're going to be producing right now. We're producing at uh one I don't know, more than one two and a half per second and we're using three per second so yeah so this is you can't really ratio it any better than that but this is awesome look at that stream coming in going to 11 houses this is awesome and what we could actually do down here is I think a farm can start getting where's our farm Will they harvest apples or will they not harvest apples? Look at that one. That's an amazing one. Uh, you need a forester for that. Do we have a forester yet? No. I think that was the next thing that was going to be on our list to to research, right? Forestry. 
Because so what you can do with forestry is you come down here and you put a forester right here, and they're going to start collecting apples. And apples should go on a shoot. But then they have to kind of then go up anyway, right? Yes, they will. Okay. Um, I want to elevate these just so we're not... I should actually move this down one, but that's okay. Is go up like that. And that should... That's a bit wonky there. Because shoots are significantly faster. But it's okay because it'll stay bunched up. And then we're going to start getting apples and our citizens are going to start being much happier. Oh, look, we got apples already. Now, the only thing we need is raw grain, which I think this is where we're going to... Let's just pause this. Move this away. Move this away, this away. And then move this here, move this here. This, this. Um, move that. Can you not do that? Occupied, what does that mean? Okay. All right, then we're just going to go in here. We're just going to delete things because it's super annoying to not do it like that. <laughs> and there you go. This should be deleted too. Come on. There. So we're going to put this one here, here. And then we're going to go here, here. And then we're going to drag this up like that. And then like that. And then, yeah, that's the thing. It says you can't like reuse these. I mean, you can move them, but it kind of is pointless. So I want to grab from here. I didn't do what I wanted to do anyway. I'm going to go this way and we're going to go this way. Oh, I don't have enough. What do I have enough of? Wait, what? Enough. I have, t oh, I don't have enough um, planks. Okay. And then we just got to put a grabber. Oops. Grabber here. That should work, right? Uh, no. Okay. Um, I think I just have to change the way this works. Again, I hate. Come on. That. And then if we put the grabber back. Yes. Let's max this out, by the way. And we're going to grab this here. Drag that into there. What? It's going up. What's the problem? There. Now we're going to have grain. Now our, oh, yes, our population goes up because everybody's happy. This is great. This should be fine. We're still importing as fast as we can. Once this, if these start backing up, then we can reduce the amount of workers. So I'm not sure if we're going to need basically four and a half per second right now. <clears throat> we don't need it for this. This is full. And it, why is this like, oh, eventually this will get full. Okay, yeah, so we don't need that amount of workers. We can, Let's cut it down to six. I mean, we're going to add more houses very soon. All right, this here is basically doing nothing. So let's just get rid of. This building is just annoying me. There's, there's no point to have these guys here right now. Um, do we have any... Do we have a shop or a barn? We do have a barn. We need planks, though. Okay. So, these guys here... We need to start making planks somewhere else. Which, I mean, this looks like a really good area to do it right here. Or even doing it right here, actually. Let's just put all these guys here. Let's just make a... Oh, we can get the forester. Oh, no, we can't. We don't have enough planks. Duh. Planks. Okay, so we just need to make planks. Um, what's the problem here? Oh, we have, like, no input. Because we only have one thing. This is making planks, too. Isn't this making planks? All right, let's... um. I want this one to make planks. This one isn't doing anything, right? Oh, that one's making the pipes. Because I need to have some planks going in here. 
let's increase the way that the shoots work like that these two can harvest this way these two can harvest this way I don't need you here anymore sorry bye bye we can go under a G layer and drag that to here I bet you could store water in one of these crates too. There we go. So I just need more planks. How are we doing here, guys? We're doing good. We're not really doing anything with this at the moment. Hmm. More if it makes sense to almost move this down to a more central location. But we have apples coming in. This is great. We have coal, which we don't need. Back here, we have a whole bunch of things that I'd like to get to. I wonder if this is where it makes sense to start making, like, working on, like, a railway system. But I think we are out of time for today. I want to thank you guys for watching. Please comment, like, and subscribe. Hit that bell notification button. Next time, we're going to start doing more stuff, doing more factory building. All right, guys. Thanks for watching.